Meet Barney and Devils, two X-ray sources who are in the care of an animal aid campaign member. Barney is an 18-year-old bay gelding, and Devils a 17-year-old chestnut. Like most racehorses, their time in racing wasn't especially long. When they both picked up injuries, their owners soon wanted rid of them as they could no longer win money. Barney and Devils were fortunate enough to find a home for life. Sadly, this isn't the case for thousands of horses who leave the racing industry. It's distressing to think that a huge number of these beautiful animals who have been exploited for financial gain and potential glory are sent to slaughterhouses or fed to hunting hounds. And some are even rendered down into byproducts by knackermen. Barney and Devils were lucky, but they both suffered serious injuries. Barney has a sway back, likely due to being inbred. He also bowed a tendon which is a common injury amongst racehorses that leaves them painfully lame for a long period of time, therefore unable to race. Devils suffered from exercise-induced pulmonary hemorrhage, in which blood vessels in his lungs burst when racing at speed. He literally choked on his own blood that gushed out through his nostrils. This again is a common injury that many racehorses suffer. It quickly ends a horse's racing career if not their lives. Each year in Britain, around 200 horses die racing. Horses who raced against both Barney and Devils were killed, and they never had the chance of a retirement, enjoying a sunny day in a paddock. They will have just known the strict regime of training and racing, and getting brutally whipped whilst trying their best. When not racing, they will have been banged up in a stable for most of their short lives. If you want to help racehorses, please sign Animal Aid's petition. Just follow the link.